Hello, gardening friends. Welcome to the Weekend Gardener. I'm John Drumgool. I can take this off for a few moments, but keep it on when you're not uh, necessarily in the garden. Very important. Since we're at home and we're looking for projects to do, the kids, you, whatever it is, um, it's easy to propagate. Why don't you make some more plants? And the way to do that is to use a material like this one right here that is good for cuttings. It drains well, it doesn't stay real wet, and that way the cuttings don't get overwatered and they get what they need and a little bit of earthworm castings and they're on their way. Cuttings can be made of all kinds of different things. Here's an example. This is an impatience right here. Now, uh, impatience sometimes are hybrids. They belong to other people. So you can't do much except grow your own with them. But that's a pretty one. That's a nice cutting right there. And it goes in. You can root them in water also. You can easily root them in water. You don't want them to wilt but you can mist it in order to keep them from wilting. And I do it with a bottle like this, a little bit of seaweed in there. They do very well. We are all are growing succulents these days. They're very, very popular. And so here's a little baby. See how that one's gotten all stretched? Well, we can start over. By doing the cutting, they're gonna come out at the base again. And I take the lower leaves off, which also root, put them in one of these little holes that I've made here. You know what the best thing to do first is dip it in a little seaweed because that has the hormone that promotes roots. So I'll do that. And then here's another cutting I, I took off of this one. It's a nice big one. That's going to turn into a beautiful little plant right there. That goes in also. You know, a couple of weeks and you've got these things rooted. Then you pot them up a little bit. Here's something that you divide. It's another way of propagating. And uh, the division is a clump like this one. You just take it, you clean it up a little bit, you put it down. This one goes into a potting soil now. You fill that in, and uh, now you're on your way to having more pots just like that. Well, that's it. Good projects for you and the kids. Good place to be is out home, at home, in the garden. Well, I'm the Weekend Gardener. I'm John Dromgul, and I will see you next week. Thank you.